So I'm Rasha Alami, I'm an interventional cardiology consultant at the Hammersmith Hospital and an interventional research fellow at Imperial College London. Stable angina is a very common condition, it affects many patients worldwide. It's a very different condition to patients presenting with heart attacks. In those patients with heart attacks, we know that opening up a blocked artery saves their life. In a po patient population with stable angina, they usually present to GP clinics or outpatient clinics saying that they have chest pain or breathlessness when they exert themselves that goes away as soon as they rest. And it's that patient population that we were looking to study in the Orbiter trial. It's a tightness in the chest and uh, not breathing properly at that time and anxiety as well. And uh, it is not good. For 40 years, we've been conducting coronary angioplasty, which is the opening up of a narrowing in a coronary artery in order to improve the symptoms in patients with stable angina. What we've never known in all of this time is how much of the symptomatic improvement that we see in our patients is due to a true therapeutic effect or due to the placebo effect of us performing an intervention. So it was important for us to perform this study to know for the first time what the true effect was of opening up a narrowed coronary artery. Uh, when I came here first time, it was uh, my other doctor sent to me to have a angiography and uh, they saw a little shadow in my arteries and they want to do this treatment and they send me to through this team, the research team. So our trial results have been really interesting and intriguing. We've now got a wealth of data that's given us some answers to our primary question, but in fact we want to study that data more. As we saw that there was no difference in the exercise time between the two groups, but there are possibly some subgroups of patients who derive more benefit from a stenting procedure. And by looking back at our data, we may be able to tease out which patients a stent truly helps. Once again, we know that stable angina is a disease that's very complex. Um, and what we expected was that to open up a narrowed artery and improve the blood supply to heart would make our patients feel better. Interestingly, that very straightforward link seems to be more complex than we expected and so we need to study that further. I feel much, much better. My life uh, style is more improved and I can walk now and I have no that sort of worries in my brain. I will have a heart attack or anything, no anxiety. I feel much, much comfortable now after the stand.